Today I'm going to show you how to make a very simple recipe to grill some pork ribs. So we're going to be using two pounds of spare ribs. We have garlic, salt, pepper, and I like to use chipotle chili pepper, but you can use any kind of chili pepper to add that kick to it. And we're going to add some barbecue sauce towards the end when we're outside on the grill. So we want to add our salt first. We want to add just enough to cover the entire area of our ribs. So we're going to add pepper, same thing, but I like to add a little bit more pepper than salt. We want it to have a nice spicy kick to it. And then depending how spicy you do like your ribs, that's how much pepper you want to put. I like to put about a tablespoon. Just enough to get in there. Again, this is two pounds of meat, so you can adjust your seasonings based on the size of the meat. So we're gonna flip our meat over and season it on the other side. I don't rub my seasoning in. I just pour right on top. And again, on the other side, salt first. pepper and then again another tablespoon of chili pepper and that's it if you want to let it sit and marinate for a while, you're welcome to do that, but I like to wrap it right away. And then we're gonna put it in the oven for two and a half hours at 300 degrees. So once we get it seasoned, we have our oven set to 300 degrees. We're now going to wrap it in foil. Once we get it completely covered in foil, we're going to put it on a baking dish. All right, so now we're gonna put the ribs in the oven and let it bake for two and a half hours, 300 degrees. Now that the ribs are done cooking, let's take a look at them. Let them rest for 10 to 15 minutes. Right, they're nice and tender, smells great. Awesome juice. Now we're gonna take these out to the grill and grill them. Alright, so it's been about four minutes, now we're going to flip them over. We're them on this side for four more minutes. They're already falling apart. So we've got about a minute left for it to cook, so I'm going to apply a little bit of barbecue sauce.
All right, so here's our taste test of the spare ribs that I just barbecued. And let's give it a taste, see if the kids like it. Jordan is my picky barbecue eater, so he's really the, the tester here. Good. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Good flavor? It's so good. I like the barbecue sauce on it. Barbecue sauce, good, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, the, with this flavor, you don't even need barbecue sauce, but I put it in there just to give it a little bit more kick and more sweetness. What do you guys think? Thumbs up, thumbs down, just okay? Thumbs up, all right, good. Well, there you go. Kids, kids approved. Thanks for watching and join us on the next video. Make sure you subscribe. Subscribe. Oh, that's going in there. Oh, yeah.